Alright, what's up everybody and welcome to the channel. About a month ago I posted a day in the life video on YouTube and right now it's at almost 180,000 views. A ton of you guys want a more vlog type of content, so here we are. I've got a bunch of stuff planned for today, I've got a lot of things that I'm trying to do, along with a full setup revamp, a new PC, so it's going to be a crazy day. So right now it's actually already around 10.30, I have been up for about an hour, just been like checking my notice, stuff like that, texting some people back. But right now is where my day really starts and where I start getting some things done. And we're starting out just like every day with a quick shower. So I've done everything for my morning routine now. I've woken up, showered, washed my face, brushed my teeth, done all kinds of stuff like that. But I need to get some breakfast because it's like 11.30 and I still haven't eaten. Now my sister's off work today and she offered if I want to go get some donuts. So I'm going to go do that and I will be right back. All right, so I just got back. It's around 11.45 and I'm still waiting on a few things to start my setup revamp. So until then, I'm just going to eat my breakfast, respond to some emails and watch some MHA. All right, so right now it's about 1.35. I just finished playing some Valve for a little while. And it's time to get started on the setup revamp that I was talking about in the beginning of the video. So right now my setup is in a pretty good spot, I won't lie, but there's a lot of things that I'm changing today. So I'm gonna walk you guys through it before I get started. So first up is the PC. Right here I have all the parts for the new build that I'm making. Basically I'm keeping the GPU and the CPU and a couple other things, but I'm getting a new case, new AIO. This is a new motherboard, some more RAM, and a new power supply to fit the new case. The position of the PC will also be changing. It'll be going flat against this corner right here since this side is see-through now. So I'll be able to have that in that corner really well. This boom will be moving a little bit. This ring light will be moving a little bit. All of this stuff on my desk will be changing up. And I think I'm gonna move this softbox a little bit, maybe put it up higher so that it puts light down like that. And maybe try to find a new angle for my camera and set up right there. So yeah, a lot of stuff in the main setup area is changing as well as just a general cleanup because this whole area is very dirty. All of the area around my setup is dirty. All of this, I have Amazon packages boxes. There's the box for the case. It's just in general a mess. And the last thing that's changing is this, my cable management. I've been putting this off for like four months straight now because I've been getting a bunch of new stuff for the setup. I've been moving things around and I haven't really found something that I'm happy with yet. But today when I do my revamp and I get my new PC and everything, I'm committing to fixing all of this. Now the thing is, I don't actually know how to build a PC. This PC was built by one of my friends that lives really close to me and this new PC will also be built by him because I just haven't really taken the time to learn how to build a PC yet because I haven't really felt the need to. It would be cool to know how one day, but for now, I'm content with just driving all this to my friend's house, dropping it off there, and spending that couple hours that he's building it, cleaning my setup, giving it a full deep cleaning, a revamp, getting my new camera set up, getting my new lighting set up, all that kind of stuff. So that's the plan. I'm gonna go drive this stuff over to him now, and I'll be back. All right, so here's everything for the new build. I have my old PC, the new PC case, and all the parts back here. I like the shirt jam between them because this side is glass, and I don't want to get scratched up by this, but I think this will do the job perfectly. All right, so I just got back and for the next couple hours, I'm going to be doing the setup revamp part of this. So at the end of this, when I get my PC, all I have to do is plug it in and cable manage and I'll be completely finished. Now the first step to this setup revamp is the most boring part, but it's cleaning up all the crap around my room. I have so many boxes, wrappers, food, water bottles everywhere, G fuel on the floor. It's a mess and it really needs to be fixed. I've been putting this off for a while because it's too much of an effort to clean it, but now that I've got a couple hours to kill with nothing to do, I figure now is the best time to do it. So let's get started. So I made a lot of progress, but next up is all of these wires that desperately need to be cleaned. So for now, since I don't have a PC, I can't exactly like redo my cable management, but I'm just gonna take off all the wires, put them all in a pile on the floor, separate them and sort them so that when I get my PC, it's super easy to just plug everything in and cable manage it. But uh, yeah, it's kind of a mess right now, so let's get on that. All right, so now I'm done with that. And although the wires don't necessarily look clean right now, they weren't really meant to, I was basically just untangling all the wires and putting them all in their own little line. So it's gonna be a lot easier to cable manage once I have my PC up and running. So, now that we're done with the cable management, the next step is fixing my lighting and my camera angle that I want to change for stream. Now, all of this is purely for stream background. It's not necessarily to make my setup look cleaner, but I do dislike this big softbox right here that just kind of takes up all the space in my setup. So, I think I'm going to try to find a different place to move this and maybe put my camera between my monitors. I don't know. We'll have to see. Literally, just by moving the softbox out of the way, my setup looks so much bigger and neater. Even though this side is still really messy and I'm waiting for my PC, I really want this area to be open and have like accessibility so I can put things down here, I can set stuff, and it just 
looks so much better when it's open and I feel less cramped when I'm sitting in my setup that already has a bunch of overwhelming things looking right at me. I'm thinking that I can turn this on its side horizontally and then have it above my PC over in this side once the PC comes in. And if I move my camera to right here, it should still have a huge effect since it's right there on my face. But I'm going to try to put my camera in between these monitors and see how my angle looks for stream. So let me show you guys that. Obviously my whole background's turned off, but just to give you guys an idea, this is what my stream background looks like at the moment. This is my camera on the tripod right there, and normally all of this stuff is on, so it looks really cool. I'll throw up a screenshot from a VOD on the screen right now. But yeah, this is the angle that we're working with right now. So this is the before, and here is the after. Let me know what you guys think about this. I don't think it's too big of a change, but I do think it would kind of refresh the streams and bring something new to it, because I've had that same camera angle for a very long time. Overall, it's a pretty big change in my setup though because I have to move this left monitor over and like disconnect it from the main two, which would bring like the overall aesthetics of the setup down in my opinion, but I think it would be worth it if enough of you guys like this angle. So let me know in the comments. If you watch the streams, do you think this is the move or no? For now, I'm gonna leave the monitor set up like this and leave my camera right here. But let me know if you guys do like this. I am really interested to hear your opinions because if enough of you guys want it here instead, I will make the switch there and try to put my setup work around it. But for now, I just don't think it's worth changing everything up when I don't know how you guys will react to it. So let me know on that. For the lighting, I'm thinking I move this ring light above this monitor right here, I move that ring light over here to be my main one behind my camera, and then put this softbox above my PC when that comes in. Alright, so here's the new and improved stream lighting. Although it looks really ugly at first, both of these can be hidden, and I want to show you that real quick because this is one of the main reasons I did this. This ring light can just be taken down and put somewhere else, and I'll have it out of the way when I'm not streaming. And then for this one, I just have to loosen this stand right here, this little dial, and then this will actually collapse. Just like that. And then if you come back around to the front, you can see that the entire left side of the setup looks completely clean, and that is something that I really wanted when I redid my lighting setup. As for this, I need to wait for the PC to have this look better, but this does look a little bit neater, and this will look less weird and awkward when the PC is here under it. It'll look like this is just sitting on top of the PC, and you won't be able to see the wire or the arm or anything, so I'm really stoked for that. And now it's about 4.15, and all that's left to do is wait for my friend to finish up with the PC, so I'll just be watching MHA while I wait. So it's actually been a couple hours since I last recorded. I basically got the computer and put it on my desk and then immediately ate dinner and had some family come over. So right now it's about 10 o'clock at night and I'm about to do all the cable management and everything. But I have the PC. This is what it looks like. I absolutely love how it turned out. I think it looks amazing, fits perfectly on the corner of my desk. I haven't even turned it on yet because I haven't done any of the cable management. And I don't want to bore you guys with that, so I'll just do that and then cut to when I'm finished. So for now, this is what I got. I know it doesn't look good, but it is from the back, so you can't really tell anything. And from the front, it looks pretty good. Now, I did order a couple things for cable management, like a tray that goes right here, but for now, I think this is fine. And all that's left is to turn it on. Hey, like Costa Rica, swipe a piece of 17, but I'm gonna be a millionaire. Drift to be my buddy, sneakers, pack of wood, and my swift fit billionaire. Costa Rica, swipe a piece of 17, but I'm gonna be a millionaire. Drift to be my buddy, sneakers, pack of wood, and my swift fit billionaire. Now I'm living on my heavy shit Louis Vuitton's on my devil shit Told the kick rockin' shit kicking up pebbles Bitch, I would've chuck Cause I stay on my trevish shit Cause bitch, he bad with the And here we are at 10.30 with a final look at the setup. I like this ring light up here. I think this softbox looks a little bit tacky over here. I think I need to find another spot for it again. It's hard to fit it in my setup, but it is so important for stream lighting, which I did test and it looks pretty great. So I think I'll run this setup for a while and see how I like it, see how it ends up on stream. Overall, I think my setup looks a lot cleaner than it did before with this whole area being open and this area being open with the new PC looking absolutely amazing over there. And overall, I think today was a really productive day, even though I didn't get to stream in. Definitely one step closer to having the best gaming and streaming setup possible. Overall, I'm super happy with it. Honestly, I think this is how it'll sit for a while, at least for the next month or so. But I do have a video planned where I make the dream YouTube studio background right here, where I have this desk here that I can put my camera right about here, do unboxings and everything. So I'm going to really deck out this wall with a bunch of cool gear. That video will be out in about a week, so stay tuned for that. Overall, though, like I said, super happy with the setup and everything that I accomplished today. It was definitely a very productive day. Anyway, that's going to wrap up this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed, and if you did, please consider checking out my Twitch streams, which will be linked in the description. I stream Monday through Friday at 1 p.m. Central, and I'd really appreciate it if you stopped by there. Other than that, just stay tuned for the YouTube studio creation that's coming soon. That video will be out within the next week or so. I'm really hyped to make it. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Have a great day, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace. Hey, like Costa Rica, swipe a piece of 17, but I'm gonna be a millionaire. Drift to be my buddy, sneakers, pack of wood, and my swift fit billionaire. Costa Rica, swipe a piece of 17, but I'm gonna be a millionaire. Drift to be my buddy, sneakers, pack of wood, and my swift